Today we're testing cheap products versus expensive ones. So let's talk about that. Good mythical morning. You know, a more expensive product doesn't always mean a better product. Sometimes right. it just means a 19 year old made it trendy on TikTok. Ooh, so today we're kicking that 19 year old to the curb as we put cheap versus expensive products up against each other in order to tell you what's really worth your money. It's time for The Power of the Price. All right, blokes, in front of you are two water bottles. Your first goal is to figure out which bottle is more expensive. The mythical The gold crew one, of course. <laughs> filled them both with cold water at 33 degrees Fahrenheit oh, at 11.30 a.m. yesterday. What? So go ahead and test them out, starting by seeing which one retained the cool the best. And today you're competing for a chance to claim ownership over anything you want in the studio, even though technically you do own the No, studio. but you're saying 100%. What? You're saying 100% to one guy yeah, yeah, instead yeah. of 50 50. 50 50. Okay, so it seems like we should open and then test each one versus opening and then test, test. We don't want to open, open. Right. We want to open, test. Right. And so I'm just going to get this thing going. It is currently how, what do you think it is in here? I'd say it's probably 70 and a half degrees. Oh, yep, 70.7, .7. ha! <laughs> you read it. Here we go, so I'm gonna unscrew it. Unscrew it. Oh. Now, is it, this is a metal. It's pure gold, Link. It looks like bronze to me. And it's the that same much, color I'm on going the... in, and I am getting, ooh. It said 69 for a second. Yeah, it did. Oh, it says 69. again. 69. 69.1. 69.1 degrees Fahrenheit. Hold on, let's give it a chance. I mean, 69.1 no. is is actually pretty cold water. You know, if you jump, if people think it's warm, you jump into 69 degree water. Now I'm gonna say, okay. One of the things with this one is the top. Let me just say that basically means it's room temperature. <laughs> yeah. That just basically basically means it Seems got like it to sucks. be the temperature of the room. 69.1. This one has a lock and an unlock. So I go to unlock, then I push this button, boop, it reveals the sucker. sucker. And then when you put your mouth on that and then you put it back, the place that your mouth goes is covered up by something. Are at you least changing a the temperature bit. with all your handling? Can you just open it so I can I test it? I hope not. So I'm saying that's the first thing about this one that seems much more highfalutin than that one. Worth paying for? 69.1 is right, what we're up put against. It in. I mean, there's still- Oh, there's still ice. still ice. Oh, crap, this is so cold. 32.7 degrees, 32.5. Whoa, the gold one sucks. sucks. But there's other ways to test a water bottle. Hold on, so, hold on. You yesterday, you put water in there yesterday? Yep, 11.30 a.m. Oh, not water, it's Pacific. horrible. Uh, but that's not what we're testing. What's wrong, what, what, what kind of water is it? LA River? Here's the thing, Link. It doesn't really matter. That's just one test. Water sorbel here. Whatever water y'all putting in here is piss water. I'm gonna do what I often do to test my water bottles. I'm gonna hit it with a brick. I got a brick too. Oh gosh, look what I did to that. I nearly broke through. I can break through. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna break through this gold! Dude, that is a Oh I broke! Oh I busted it a little bit. I mean, because okay. we could do the leak test. This one doesn't Hold on, leak. Can I Hit it, hit it a number of times. I want you to do it Do it the same, same technique. Same technique. Same, same person same doing exact, the same. Same guy, same day, different water bottle. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my gosh, that is a, boy, strong. Yeah, yeah, strong. Oh, it did dent it. It did dent it. <laughs> it did, it did dent, dent it. it. But I mean, not by much. And it didn't leak out the top and it's still not leaking. But what is do you normally one? do? What do you normally do with a water bottle, Link? Link? Hike. You take it on a hike. Oh, yeah. You put it over your shoulder? <laughs> you, you take it on a hike. This one hikes pretty well. Yeah, and then you see a coyote and you oh, drop it. Oh! Oh, what just More happened? stuff came off of your bottle. <laughs> now the this bottle. part, now this part came off. That came off. All right. That's I, a high dollar bottle. Okay. I wonder which one's cheaper. Mm. Hold on, so which, what, do you, what do we do? Put our hand over the which one? Yeah. Yeah, put put over so that, put your hand, hand over. over I'm in shock. I'm, which I'm one? shook. The the more which one do you think is more expensive? Okay, remember this is gold though. More expensive. Yeah. Okay. Three, two, one. 
<laughs> I'm just going out on a little lamby lamb. <laughs> the more expensive water bottle is on Rhett's side. No! Our whole world has been turned upside down! Well, it's it's about to turn even further upside down because I'm going to tell you that the one on Link's side is an ice water 40-ounce bottle for $12.99. But the next step is for you to take the whiteboards and guess how much you oh. think the expensive how much water is that? bottle is. $13, $12.99. I mean, you know they'll charge you a lot for a water bottle, but there's nothing. Is it goop? <laughs> is this a Gwyneth thing? This is the crappiest water bottle. Are you supposed bottle. to put it in your? <laughs> I mean, we just proved this sucks. When Stevie says who this is from, we're just gonna let you have it. I mean, I'm not going too high with this thing. I am. $24.99. $39.97. Dang, son. Okay, well, I, I was saying you're about to get even more turned upside down, but I guess these numbers represent <laughs> represent that for you. Uh, the expensive water bottle is from Snow Peak Titanium Aurora. It's made with one millimeter thick titanium. Yeah, not enough. And the enough. price, $153.48. Okay, hold on. Uh-uh, uh-uh. <laughs> What's the name of the company? Snow Peak, Aurora? Uh, Titanium Aurora is the name of the, of all right. the bottle. Snow Peak, uh, hope, uh, we're glad you all gathered in your boardroom today. Uh, or maybe the break room, I don't know. I'm sure an intern's watching it first. <laughs> Welcome everyone else to the boardroom. Guys, y'all been ripping us off. How do you sleep at night? Did you see what we did in this? I bricked your thing so hard. <laughs> I mean, we got 69, now that is funny, 69 degree water. Or is, hold on, is it, is that what it's supposed to do? It makes all water 69 degrees. That's marketable. Water bottle. No dice. dice. Okay, up next we have hand soaps. Mm -hmm. And uh, to your side, you'll see some supplies for you to test them with. So go ahead and... Dirty up your hands. Now that sun, oh, that, this soap is gold, which we we know how we feel about that. I will say we got a little update from our resident Snow Peak lover, Lucas. Yes, Snow Peak. <laughs> um, he whispered in our ear. He said the thing about this that water bottle is it's so light for so for people who want to uh, hike a long way and they want their stuff to be ultra light. Of course, when you get there, your water will be, you know, room temp. <laughs> Uh, but if that's really important to you, maybe you would spend $153 on it. To make our hands dirty, we have this charred ash powder. But before we dirty our hands and make them smell bad, I feel like we need it, because you'll do gold soap, I'll do clear soap. Sure. Just smell my hands to make sure that they're, they're, the control hand is, is fine. Uh, yeah, it, it's fine. Smell mine. What you been into? What? What you been into? Nothing. Something nice. You've been you've been putting your hands in something nice. I reached down my pants and pulled the bottom of my underwear down. You know, the briefs tend to ride up. It didn't smell like that. It smelled a little floral. <laughs> I'm in bloom. <laughs> All right. So here you go. Charred ash on the hands. So do char on this hand, and then I'll do take garlic cloves, cloves, and just sort. Of, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take my rings off. I always take my rings off every morning when I like fix my hair. Do you do that? When you put the pomade you know, oh, I, in your hair? No, I don't use a product that you gotta, is gelatinous. Mine's such a liquidy product that I put in my hair, you know? I still use mythical pomade. It's I, great. I can't put mythical pomade in this hair. It'll, it'll look like uh, young Frankenstein. Oh, that's, that's dirty. Or young Einstein. Or, it's a dirty hand. Okay. So and now it's gonna be garlicky too. Oh, you're gonna, I was doing garlic hand and, and soot hand. I'm doing garlic and soot hand. Okay, I'll do soot hand. I wanna keep one hand clean in case it doesn't work. You're gonna do one hand, you're gonna do one hand cleaning? <laughs> what about the rubbing? I'm gonna rub with the clean hand, but I just didn't wanna. All right, now I wanna get rid of this so it's not here. Move that smell away. Okay, and now I'm gonna get rid of the oh, ash gonna, counter. Whoopsie dish. <laughs> And so now I'm gonna put some soap. How many Let's squirts? do the same amount of squirts. Once it starts squirting, then you'll count. Oh my goodness. One, Hold on. two, I don't have any. three squirt. For, 
This is oh, it's, it's gold soap. Gold soap don't squirt. We know it don't work. Gold squirt, gold squirt. Hold on, what's wrong? With your gold soap. Hold on, no, no, it's, don't get on the go. mic. Three squirt. One oh, half a squirt. Oh, that's nothing. No, there you go. One squirt. Two squirt. And How? then like three quarters of a third squirt. Stop short on that squirt. No, a little bit more. There we go. All right, now wet. Hmm. Rub. I like to rub. Oh, I've made this hand dirty. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Hold on. What, what technique are you doing? It's okay. You doing prayer hands? Prayer hands. What about church? <laughs> Steeple. Inside is the people. What is the thing that you do? Inside is the preacher. <laughs> it's not a popular church. What about a little of that? Every finger. There you go. This is not even the hand that was dirty. I gotta stand up and get an angle on this. I'm uncomfortable with how close my hair tie I is. I think my this. scent is nice. Just, I told you I told you your scent was nice. No, the gold scent. Oh. Okay. Gee, I may never get up to wash my hands again. <laughs> this is so fabulous. Look at that. I am so clean. And now I am gonna do a little dry action, but not too much. So they don't smell like paper towels. And then you give me your hand, I'll give you my hand. In three, two, one. Wow, there's no garlic. Man, it smells good. No, no, no. Let me smell your fingertips. <laughs> oh, yep, 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 yep. Garlic. Garlic on your fingertips, too. How much? On a scale of one to 10? Uh, you got a three. I'd say a six, a oh, five. Oh, really? Smell your own. See, a lot more fingers of, of garlic. <laughs> Let me smell yours. Left. No garlic here. Hold on. <laughs> give, now, give, now, now give me yours. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I think your hands smell better than mine. My hands. Uh, I think his hands. My hands smell better. I think they smell better. What about your softness? I don't have particularly soft hands. Right. I think that's. Uh, you think you're ready to guess? I yeah, think yeah. I'm ready to guess. Yes. Yeah. Hand over the more expensive one. In three, two, one. <sighs> Yeah. Oh, I'm going against you instinct. Changed. I'm nope. going against yep, yep. instinct. The more expensive soap is on Link's side. Yes. Mm -hmm. right. So it is, and we it did. Is, it is true. It is true. What is it? The cheap soap on Rhett's side is Target brand Everspring soap for two ninety nine. Cool packaging. A Twelve ounce bottle. Three dollars. So now you wait. No. Well. What? Okay. It doesn't have a price on it. I yeah. guess so. It's fine. This is what it is. Because that's the next step in this format Aesop? is that oh, you what, guess. So you said the, the, well, the this one is Everstring is how much? It's two ninety nine. Okay, that um, Aesop place. I, how I'm much hoping is the, your Aesop is knowledge is. It might not be nothing. Aesop. I go. <laughs> I go in that place sometimes, and they're very helpful. <sighs> they're very helpful in there. Have you noticed that? They're very helpful in there. We have those bottles at my house, but I think we fill it up with something else. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You fill it up with tart with the, this stuff. <laughs> yeah. I mean. I still smell garlic. I'm gonna need your good soap here in a second. That's a pretty big bottle of soap they brought in for a moment. That's some hot bottle of soap, I believe. Okay. 27.86. Oh, 21.99. It's also apparently pronounced Aesop. Aesop. I mean, who's who's to know? They probably won't correct you though. Um, forty one dollars for a Dang. sixteen point nine ounce. Uh, Good bottle. gravy. The fact that we forty one dollars paid for this $41? once and then refilled it with some cheap junk is making me feel bad. Is it so? Is it worth it? Well, <sighs> resurrection aromatique. I don't know if I mean. Literally beyond 10x the price. You can yeah. put your whiteboard down. <laughs> That's cray cray. I feel like I'm willing to deal with a little garlic on the fingers for the rest of the night. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't know. I'm not. No, it's too expensive. Hand soap. No dice. Nice. In your second episode titled The Santa Dilemma, you gave advice to somebody who gave a gift to their boss that went unacknowledged. Do you remember what that gift was? This was the uh, ostrich farm. Mm. Yeah. That's correct. Um, what if I told you that the ostrich farm tickets were gifted from somebody in this company to this company, and we have them? Wait, yeah, can we please send in? You're the guy? Welcome to the Try Zone. Try guys not included. <laughs> uh, 
All right, nothing puts uh, tricycles to the test like two grown men over six feet tall riding them, so please, uh, go ahead. Oh, this one's heavy. This oh. is kind of heavy, too. Okay. All right, you want to see if you can... Uh... We're going to race. We got a troll. I just goosed myself. <laughs> okay, well, hold on. So, let me see if I can get my... Can you even? Can you even? <laughs> okay. Are your legs... I think if I cross my legs and put them on the other side... <laughs> uh, I think I can almost do it that way. Is there a way... Hold on. Is there a way to... Hold on. I don't think I'm going to get out of this. <laughs> Is there a way... Is there a way for me to put my butt on it and then put my... <laughs> to put... Oh, yeah. How, going? See, how are you doing that? I don't know. It's like... I think that these are actually... These feel like they're about to break, but... Let me see if I can get on that one. Why are they, are the pedals are, the, are the, the, not opposite. Did I do that? Oh, you may have done it. You may have done it. You may have. Uh... All right, try to get on that one. I'll try this one. Oh, this one's tighter. You're right. I think I can do it though. Because maybe if I could go over the steering wheel. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> that boom was the tricycle. That wasn't my mouth. Push me to get me going. <laughs> there we go. Here we go. Uh, yeah, there. Why are the wheels so out of whack? Well, that's because you weigh too much. Yeah. Uh, I think I'm too big. Oh, oh. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm too big. Should we break it? No, no, no. It's fine. Break it? It's no. fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We need a smaller rider. Yeah, yeah. It's fine. Is Lily here? Yeah, I'm here. Oh, okay. Um, uh, we're gonna, we're gonna fix this for you. Yeah, nothing, to, nothing to see here. It's totally fine. The tricycle's fine. It's totally fine. Just get it. Turn it. Yeah. All right. Th oh, there you go. It. I got it. All Hop right. on that one, Lily. Right. There we go. Pay attention to, you know, like ease of steering and. Uh, Broken. This okay. one. This one is great. Okay. Keep going. Oh, okay. Wait, oh, okay. All right, now that how oh, you broke it, you broke hey, it. Hey, eat my dust, Lily. Oh, <laughs> Lily broke eat it. My, forget it, forget it. Um. Okay. Uh. Do you want to let Lily uh, ride that one? You're dragging a cone. Get rid of the cone. Hey, calm down a little I mean, bit, bro. I'm boy. I'm I'm trying to go. <laughs> Come on, Lily, why'd you give up so quickly? I beat you. It's, it's two It's two laps. Uh, She's forfeit. Oh, goodness gracious. Hey. Bring it, bring it back over here. Okay. Um, well, all I can say is one broke. <laughs> Lily, you want to ride this one and, and compare the two? Yeah, yeah, you see what you think. And uh, she also gets a vote. Oh, I ate too many sandwiches at lunch. Oh, give me a break. <laughs> oh, I don't like the way it makes my butt feel. <laughs> Ooh. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Okay. You're a kid again. <laughs> that, I mean, that's so a pretty like, smooth ride, it looks yeah, like. Yeah, smooth. <laughs> oh, there are two laps. Okay, you just... <laughs> All right, we're ready to vote. Uh, Lily, do you have Actually, any, we're not ready to vote yet. Any strong we, We're going to be in a second. Um, this now, one's... we're ready to vote. This one's smoother. <laughs> out, of out of breath, breath huh? Yeah. Okay, I think I know which one I'm voting for. Okay, put your hand over the one that you think is more expensive in three, two, one. That's right. I am voting for the crappy one intentionally. What? This feels like one of those like specialty ones that like from some like Swiss toy store. Bye, Lily. Um, it's yeah. a little too old fashioned and simple. Yeah. This one like it has a bell. I think this is one of those the way that it's made with fancy with fancy this stuff, companies. It's, it's got red buttons everywhere. Well, let's find out. The more expensive tricycle is the red one. Oh, okay, okay. The cheap green tricycle is a brand called Confident for $69.99. So they're, how they're much? They're compensating for something. How much do you think the red one costs? You said this is $69.99? Yeah. Oh, thank you for bringing Tricycle that. prices seem to have really gone up, yeah, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because that was a cheap one for $69.99. $70. Yeah. This is turning into an expensive episode. Uh, $69.99 here, $153. Uh, we've ruined a number of things. I think we could salvage that expensive soap, though. Uh, I'm telling you, man, this is one of those fancy-smancy companies. Like, 
the kid who rides this is named like Donovan. You know what I mean? Donovan. Or Tanner. Tannerford. <laughs> Tannerford. You're going to be absolutely blown away with how much this thing costs, Link. I, I, I'm just saying $189. $219.99. What? $97. $219.97. It's from classic writer Tykes, and uh, it costs $249. Woo! What? 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 It's not I can't worth believe it. it. <laughs> it ain't worth it. It's that, I, well, it is pretty smooth. It is, you look great on it, too. Now that you, if you miss the cones. So this expensive tricycle, no, no dice. dice. Well, Rhett, you get to choose anything in the studio to own fully yourself. Oh, um, Got to make a quick choice. Um, logs. I own the logs. <laughs> I can live with that. Thanks for subscribing and clicking that bell. You know what time it is. I'm Sarah. And I'm George. And this is Link. And, and it's, it's time, time to spin, spin the Wheel of Mythicality. Uh, a cat was named after you. How do you feel about that? I love it. Okay, click the top link to watch us show a random picture in our camera roll based on different keyword searches. This is going to be fun. Uh-oh. Get to more. And to find out where the wheel's going to land. When I did it, I then shook, went really quickly. I had his ashes in my pocket, <laughs> put him down on home plate, rubbed the grass, took a second and looked up. And I didn't feel anything. 